Here we go. Hurry up. Whoop, what's up? Message on Twitch. Testing. One, two, three. Hurry up. We are up. <coughs> morning, ladies and gentlemen. Let me see what we're up to this morning. Back with the magic pencil. What's today? Today's Wednesday. It's a normal day for us. Uh, it's a new month today. Cameron will be here, I guess, around a normal time, in half an hour or so. He'll be busy today. It's the first of the month, so he's got all his subscription building and stuff like that to take care of today. Hairdresser day. I wish I wish I was. Hey, Tony, the map, the map. I know I told you about this before. I know. We had this conversation. Send me a link to this and we'll pay for it. Oh, well, Mokohan can happily sponsor that map if you want. I don't know where it is. So send me the link, the information. Send it to Cameron and he can, you know, put put the payment in there and get that map back alive. So uh, please send the info to Cameron. Let him know what's going on now. Jetsan, good morning. Ah. For her, yes, it's okay. For her. <laughs> okay. What is the email? Anything, just send it to uh, info, info at mokohankan.com and Cameron will get it or send it to this Twitch channel, whatever, uh, anything. Or go to the Mokohankan website, there's a contact form there, use that contact form. There's a million ways to get it like this. Okay, this is a tangled mess of hair. Coxa has really given her a tangle. There's a smooth areas of hair, there's tangled areas of hair. For those of you who weren't in on this the other day when we were starting this, this area, for example, I'll center it at the bottom of the screen here. Just above the calligraphy here. You can see I've already drawn two red hairs. I've drawn, traced them in. And the next zone, just above the red hair, there's alternating gray and black and gray and black and gray and black. And it's misleading. The black parts you see there should actually be white space. The gray parts are the real hair. The black parts are tamadi. It's black paste is filled in the lines. So my job today is to sort this out. The area that is the medium black is the area that's the hair. I have to take away the white areas and take away the black areas with the glue stuffed in there. So let's start with a simple part here so that I can sort of just get track of what's going on. My other glasses. If you're not sure what's happening, just relax. It'll become clear as I do more of it. So just, just hang in there. I certainly don't have the brush skills to outline all these strokes in a single stroke, so it's a question for me of coloring it in. You see, we're going to find another hair going down the middle here. So the white spaces clearly are the gaps between hairs. It'll be way faster for you to carve this. The knife just slices through one hair at a time. Slice, slice, slice. Way faster to carve than it is to draw. black line there, which indicates there really was a hair in the original print. There was a white gap.
in the next part of this, that hair it looks okay at this point, red, but if we pop up the intermediate block layer, you can see how bad that hair is still. We have to fix these. We have to get them as smooth as possible. Again, we're focusing on this white, white at the moment, not the black. Jeez, comments, comments, comments. Oh, Tommy Jet, good, okay, okay, good, good, good. You guys chat.
Okay, we're getting close. This is also too hugely large. By the time we get to the real job, it'll be so tiny and small. And this is quite a bit of overthinking here. But the neater and cleaner I can get them at this stage, the neater and cleaner the cart lines will be. Okay, that's one zone done, let's move on. Questions, questions, what's this? Dave, all caught up on paper for now. I'm not sure what you mean. You mean sizing and stuff? No, I'll probably be doing sizing again tomorrow. Good, good, good. It's the first of the month here in Japan now, August the 1st, so we have closed off a month last night. The shop was open here in the evening yesterday. You know, Tuesday actually is technically our closing day, but while I was working, I was doing various stuff, free market preparation, all kinds of different you know, desk jobs and stuff, packing some prints. So while I did that, I just kept the store open. There's no point in keeping the shutter down and have people outside looking for you. So I just kept the shutter open while I was doing my work. And it was a good day. Good day in shop right through till the evening. And it turned out, you know, I was going to chat with Cameron when he gets here. He's going to ask, you know, how did it go as far as the monthly total goes? You know? And uh, it's really, really funny. But <laughs> it's the, the Asakusa shop had its best month, best month that it's ever had in, in terms of straight sales revenue, which is to be expected because we've now opened near the ground floor here. But uh, that previous best month was last, I don't know, was it March or April? I don't know, maybe. One, two, three, four, four, April. The previous best month was April, right in the middle of the cherry blossom season. And this month has topped up. And it's incredible because July is usually a fairly quiet summer hot month. And it has just become the biggest month we've ever had in the Asakusa shop. Which I guess is, is to be expected. We've made the investment in the first floor and it looks like it's you know going to uh, going to work out. What's now going to happen come the actual really busy tourist season, the, the next cherry season, and this year's autumn season? My God, I don't know. I don't know. It's also too high. We've talked about this before. I have to try and train myself not to start looking at all these numbers like a game, you know. Oh wow, the number's going up, the number's going up, we sold more stuff, you know. It's really a, 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 a trap to, to get into that stuff, you know. So. But it's there, it's, an, it's a normal part of business. You do your bookkeeping and stuff, and there it is. It looks like a scoreboard, like a sports thing.
what's going on here. My pencil has decided to stop working. Hang on a second. Oh, it's a battery and pencil. Oh, ta, 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 ta. I thought it charged it before our session started here. Pause while we charge the pencil here for a minute. I think the pencil's getting all the battery inside. I don't know. I've been using it for a year or so now. It doesn't seem to hold the charge. It used to be you could charge it for two or three minutes and just run all day. It doesn't seem to want to do that anymore. Yeah, the sales numbers about payroll and stuff like that. We don't have a, it doesn't, it doesn't work so simply, you know, because our, our income is up and down, spring and fall are up and summer is down. It's a wavy signal during the year, but the payroll just runs straight through the year. So it's not a question of sales each month to hit payroll. We can only calculate that on a year by year basis, really. So, so the monthly sales for us are not a thing that we've made payroll of. Excuse me, when I charge my pencil, what a what a uh, sign of the times to show. Jed's out, is he? I... Let's see. That should give us a few minutes. Let's see what happens. Should be a charge here? Where was I? Excuse me while I charge my pencil. It really is surreal, isn't it?
Oh. I don't know how many pencil does that explode. Did you see him coming? I didn't see him coming. I just jumped. Yeah, <laughs> that door has a sticky, yeah. sharp sound on it. So. Hey, Jerry, are you early today? I'm 34. A bit, yeah. I was thinking it was going to be you first or Dave Chanford. I wasn't sure who was coming. So. I win. <laughs> you win or you lose. I don't yeah. know. <laughs> take over, take over. They were chatting. They were chatting with Jed a while ago about something oh, else, and I've just been sort of just sketching and without following what's going on. Oh, thanks, Jed, for running the stream. He's gone. He's coming. Oh man. <laughs> The mic is right there between us, it should be okay. okay. Sounds good. There's a couple of new faces, I don't know if they know who you are, whatever. This is Cameron Sam, one of our Something. helpers or whatever. Worker bees. <laughs> oh, yeah, worker bees. Yeah, yeah. worker bees. <laughs> I keep going up here, I keep going too high, like tracing up here and I can't see it. So oh, uh, yeah. I'm oh, trying to remember. If you notice that I'm out yeah. of view, give me a yell or something. Okay. <laughs> Apparently several other people jumped too when I... Sneaks around the corner and opens the door. Yeah, I made a sharp sound, I made a sharp crack sound. Like I, I literally jumped. Here. What? Sorry. The knock first. <laughs> Did you see the figure last night I sent over the rail? <laughs> it's funny. Uh -oh. it's like, no, what happened? No, no, no. Well, we were talking about maybe the oh. essential shop this month might be, or last the month. The best, yeah. Might have been the best month. We made it by 7,000 yen. <laughs> Compared to, and they say it's one flea market, but it's like 7,462 oh, wow. yen. It's the biggest mark we've ever had. Wow. We expect so because of the new shop, you know. But yeah. Uh, wow. I wasn't quite sure if it would be. Yeah. Is that highest sales, including online well, this is just, and this, I'm just, just in shop? Just, just wow. Just in shop. So. Subscriptions are steady, online is strong. Yeah. This was just the shop. Wow. Well, I was mentioning, you know, it becomes, if I think about those things too much, it becomes the wrong way to think about yeah. your business. You know, oh my God, it's a high score. We got more money this month. Yeah. Like, stuff. And like, ah, new high score. We're so on the leaderboard. Just, so, yeah. so, 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 so. It just becomes crazy. You know? Need a ding dong activated in the entrance alcove. <laughs> Bring the, the ding dong bells downstairs. Now that I'm here, everyone's quiet. Well, I'm glad. It's been a quiet stream. I've been yeah. Jed was chatting well about European trips and Comic Cons in Europe and stuff. Oh, wow. And, uh, I got I to got focus on this. I can't look up and back yeah, and forth. Yeah. I, need my, I need my closed glasses for this so I can't see the screen. I'm no, sorry. Yeah. So you're doing now the darker hair? This is the darker black. Black. The darker hair. So it's got, oops. It'll have the. Uh, the, her over here overlay, it'll be the octopus eyes, and mm. it'll be those little black dots of sort of seaweed, yeah. whatever structures. Okay. Yeah. Smallest ants. My subscription from July arrived today at my home in Portugal. It took almost a whole month to get there. Was it the uh, first one with the box or yeah. something? Or, or, uh, uh, I don't know. 
put you have too much experience there. Also, before I forget, somebody, oh, I forget the handle name, I know, the map that people check off where they're watching the stream yeah. from, it was up there for a few months. I guess it's a, right. it was on a trial. It hit the limit. It hit the limit. Yeah. So he, he was on here this morning earlier. And I said, yeah. whatever, we'll pay for it all. And Mokong, well, how will he sponsor that? Yeah. He can't pay a lot much money, right, to do that? I, mean, I don't think thing. so. So I asked him, send, send, us, send us an email. Yeah. And we'll look it up and we'll, I don't know if we can pick it up without starting from zero again. Right. right. Anyway, right back and forth to him. And hmm. we'll either we pay him and he can continue it or we can yeah. just pay it directly or whatever. We'll have we sponsor that. That's okay. Yeah. So there, there may be an email waiting for you now. Okay, cool. So no, nope, this month was just the print. Last month. The smallest day I have to cut the box. So no, no customs problems or yeah. stuff like that? Or custom, we're always... Yeah, sometimes you, mm. I get charged a huge bill and other yeah. times no it's problem at all. So. This box going to be fun to carve. Just these curves of hair lines. They're just so much fun. Yeah. Your knife just zoom, 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 zoom. You know. I can't really draw them well, but uh, once we're carving, it'll be cool. You know. Yeah. Like, like uh, the hair on infestation. Yeah, that kind of yeah. thing. This, this is a bit different. These are mostly going to be carved away rather than carved in. Cause oh. they're, yeah. The hair mass, I mean, the, the, this part of it, the zigzag, will be carved, you know, mm. like, like normal hair. But the mass like this, it's carved as a black mass, then I carve away the white parts. Okay. Which is easier. So it's a bit more forgiving of the, yeah. the flow of the hair. It's the first, I guess you're, you're busy with billing stuff today. So did you charge it yeah. off yesterday to get it ready? Or? Yep, I uh, did a couple of them actually okay. without sending out the emails just to get things ready. So today's not so full. But... Okay. Good night, Lillian. Let's go on to bed. Um, it's info on nap. Pricing. Okay, we've got a link to Okay, got it going? Yeah. Good, good. Can't be that much. Sure, if you want. Safari's down. Right. Good, I think. It looks a bit ziggy zaggy, ziggy zaggy here, but we're at stupendous enlargement. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. 
1975 Drax. Just got an email from you. How did you just get one? <laughs> Maybe one from yesterday. <laughs> I've been here. I didn't write in, but um, let's see. Uh, Drax isn't that Contar's, Contar's email handle? Yeah, I thought. I don't know. New name. Oh yeah, it was, it was yesterday. Um, Stray she. Maybe I'm pronouncing it right. So if Ayumi-san comes back to print, maybe you can see if you can start a new printer trainee slash childminder at the same time. So to learn to print and watch kids. I don't. If you're learning a new skill, I don't think watching a kid at the same time will work too well. I'm not quite sure what the yeah. Contar jumps and says, yeah, that's not me, but my email does have Drax in the name, so you, it's just, people just like Drax, I guess. Is it a game reference or something? I think, I said it's Lord Guardians of the Galaxy, a Marvel character, okay. I think. Okay. No discussion about tea today? <laughs> Good morning. Oh, daytime course, it's Wednesday, so 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 Good morning. We're going to have a crowd of wingmen today here. Hey, Chan, good morning. I haven't seen you in when? Nearly a week, is it? I don't remember. Yes. Oh. Let's sit in the middle of the side. We're having a very quiet stream here this morning. Yeah. So we just stare quietly at everybody. We sit some watches, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yep. Both of the people who use Jax in their name say, no, it wasn't related to the Guardians of the Galaxy, where there is a character named Jax. They, one used it for Dungeons and Dragons, and one for World of Warcraft. So, <laughs> all sorts of stuff. Cool. There are too many Draxes. Yep. How was your weekend day town last week? Okay. Good, yes. Good family time, summertime? Mm -hmm. okay. In typhoon. In the typhoon, <laughs> yes. Yeah. Did you guys get hit or something? Or what, were you out traveling? Or? Yes, uh, we were on the um, highway uh -huh. when the typhoon was literally coming yeah. to the high highway. And Good then we just like yeah, <laughs> yeah we, we were just like running away from typhoon. I was like, oh, it's okay. So, yeah. This is your dad's idea of a yeah. good family outing, is it? So, a nice, responsible guy. <laughs> well, we Let's all take my whole family agreed, in a car so... and head into a typhoon, you know. Yeah. Oh, it's, it's... It was middle, middle of the typhoon, so mm. that was fine. Mm. And we just, like, seen forecast and just yeah. planning. So, yeah. we're like, I think we are fine. We are good. So. Let's take my family and go storm chasing yeah. <laughs> in Japan. It wasn't everything was my dad's um, Okay, okay. Okay. So we're just heavy rain and stuff? And, uh, mm -hmm. It wasn't that bad. That's good. Say, so, I'm just trying to get you to start training more printers. <laughs> <laughs> the idea. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Person say how many more Kankan stuff does it take to change a light bulb? One to screw it in, and two to read the stream. <laughs> I was like, I was like it's very one good, very good. Who's that? Dead Steve. <laughs> so I was like, which light bulb is there? <laughs> oh, you know, you know, you know that's a joke. joke. It's a classic joke. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where what where were the where did the light bulb joke start? It's I have no idea. Yeah, it's ago. been what was a the original time. light bulb joke? I don't know. It's does anybody so know? Where, does, where did that meme, long before the internet, Yeah. How where did, did the light, light bulb, bulb meme jokes start? Come from? How many X does it take to change a light bulb? Yeah. 
I don't know. It was probably something sort of gender sexist. How many oh, women does sure. it take to change a light bulb or something? Yeah. 24, one to hold the bulb, and 23 to turn the room or something yeah. specifically gross like that. Yeah. I don't remember. What was a Polish joke or something? Uh, like probably. So probably a vaudeville act or something. Yeah. It's a classic insult type joke, right? Yeah. Know? How many X type of person does it take to change a light bulb? And the answer is always more than one, because it's supposed to be one. But, uh, okay. How do you explain a joke? <laughs> Wikipedia says Polish, and here's a link <laughs> in case you're interested. <laughs> well, how many Poles does it take to change a light bulb? Probably. What was the insult, though? Uh, light bulb joke. Should I click this? <laughs> <laughs> well, if you click it, you'll jump to Safari. So. Even though the chat is in Chrome, it doesn't open in another Chrome tab. I don't know. The default browser for the machine is set to Safari. Okay. My book well, is but, a yeah. joke that asks how many people of a certain group are mm. needed to change replies or screw in a light bulb. Mm. So, the yeah. answer is always more than one. Yeah, this one is three. One to hold the light bulb and two to turn the ladder. Something like that. Yeah, it's not the original So it's one. not it's one person... Like that, yeah. Turning it, yeah. he holds it, and the two other people turn the ladder he is on. <laughs> the, the, <laughs> the, the point being to show how dumb they are. That's yeah. your first time you've heard this. All right. Yeah, That's new so joke. Cool. So I'm seeing a person. Yeah. You're now, you now part of Western English culture. Congratulations. Yeah. Welcome to the club. Yeah. <laughs> so, what? It's funny, Dechen Lasse, because the other day she was making puns, and they, yeah. she'd been introduced to the idea of pun yeah. in English, so she was listening to puns and laughing yeah. and making some of her own. So All right. One by one, you're learning these important parts mm, yes. of well, British Western culture. You know? Yeah. So apparently started in the late 60s. Oops. Don't point at me. Don't look at me. It <laughs> wasn't my idea. It wasn't my idea. <laughs> How many drummers? There's one to hold the light bulb oh. and three to drink until the room spins. Oh, so is it like sarcasm then? Yeah, it's just totally sar sarcastic yeah. or insulting. Yeah, I mean, it's just, just to not insult nice. a specific ethnic group or genre. Like I said, musicians insult drummers, other people insult Polish people, you know, whatever. Yeah. Men will insult women or something like this. It's, it's, yeah. it's sort of the kind of humor that we're not supposed to do these days, but whatever. Is, the joke isn't known in Japanese then, or at least not to you. No. You've never heard this before in Japanese? No, not in yeah. these yeah. light bulb jokes. Well, Japanese probably thought, how many gaijins does it take to change a light bulb or yeah. something? I don't know. I don't think we see No, and he'll go through the... Bureaucracy. He'll avoid the bureaucracy and change it himself. So, no. Sorry. <laughs> I'm too quiet. Right? Yeah. <laughs> we don't really say sarcasm in Japanese, no, I guess. No, it's not really. How many flies does it take? Does it take to screw in a light bulb? Too, oh, okay. You have to be careful, Rachel, because this is some different kinds of puns yeah. here. Um, okay. This one says flies. It says two, but don't ask me how they got in there, because the yeah, flies just mysterious. Screw in a sense is being used in a different in a different meaning. Ah. Okay. Actually, <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> right. whatever. It, that's that's just what yeah. it is. That's hard. Yeah, it's, yeah. Anyway, sorry, I'm avoiding Moving right along. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Kantar. Mm -hmm. Do you know how many, or do you know what you say when you have 10 ants? Arigato. Yeah. Kantar. How old, <laughs> he was just how, how like, old did he say he was? <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> just everybody sighed together. <laughs> everybody knows something about Japanese. So. Yeah. Oh, 
Okay. Det er så er Has has yeah. our Twitch stream sunk to this level? Uh, yes. All we can do is tell silly kids jokes. Yes, that, that pretty much. It's the beginning of the end, you know. It's the beginning of the end. If that's where we're at, then we're doomed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> is it the fault of the streamer or the wingman? Oh no, it's probably us. You guys are both fixated on this street, on this chat. That's yeah. Going on. <laughs> I might as well just go home. Yeah. yeah. No. You're, you're getting lots of work done. Yeah, I am, I am, I am, I am. I feel so awesome. She left at the Harvard one. Yeah. So, do you want to sure. read that one? Okay. Yeah. How many Harvard students does it take to change a light bulb? Just one. He holds the light bulb and the universe yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right, right. That one writes itself. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. Uh, that one is like, I kind of get it. I used to really like the panda slash it's bread panda joke. Yeah. Panda? Like hmm. panda. Hmm. Uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah. There must be a longer version of it. You can't just say panda. <laughs> but yeah. Probably some context. Anyway. I used to say pan, it's pan, pan, no one got it because it's bread in English. But oh. I thought it was pan. And I also like zbon, zbon, and no one got it. What is zbon? Like, yeah, like trousers. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah. That's funny. Nineteen seventy-five Drex. So I must admit, I was drooling looking at all the prints in the new browser bin. So thanks for taking a look at the blog. Your blog uh, post no, from so, yesterday, so, so, yeah. So but those pictures are so bad. I was really embarrassed by that. Actually, yeah. the light from above is so strong, and the, the it's and the sides the right are too small. So 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 balance. For if, you, if you pop up the images, they're readable, but other than that, they're not. So I don't know. Yeah. Anyway, it was just to try and show what we've got. Mm-hmm. They just have not, to come in to get a closer look. Yeah, it's not a great selection <laughs> compared to the shops found in Jimbocho, you know, which have been in business for a hundred years. We yeah. don't really have much of a selection yet, but it's growing. But it is growing. Still our main business. You know, we are not a used print shop. We're a publisher. Our main mm -hmm. business. And most of our revenue comes from the prints we publish. Mm -hmm. so I mean, yeah, main deal. Yeah. And this whole thing about the, the flea market is a new... Mm -hmm. New experiment for us, and we, we can't make enough prints ourselves to, to fulfill the demand. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think you might now be out of the frame. I'm not seeing that line. Um, this is the, just the checking point. Okay. Where am I going to go next? Let's just do some of these individual lines then. Let's move along. Oh, yeah, I'm just right? worried. Mm -hmm. Someone heard you just say, well, we can't keep up, so that's why we're using or doing the flea market immediately. Start more printers, but if you know of any experienced printers who want to start working at Mocha Hong Kong, give us a call. But no, we should be also, we should be starting. We should be trying to hire some more. Ones. Yeah. We're sort of doing okay. We've got Kanai san, Suga san, you know, Yamamoto, and Kubota part time. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're keeping up to it, but uh, yeah. we just could 
if we had access to more printers, we could just do so much better. Yeah. Uh, the training you just said, just what to do about training more, it's just not so simple. Really. Yeah. Where would you put more printers? Well, right now we have four seats, and they're kind of permanently occupied by people, but they aren't there every day. Mm -hmm. So we could yep, make, them, make them, yeah, like trade position. out seats Absolutely. when they're in and out. And so we're thinking of expanding the room anyway. Yeah. So. That's the physical space at the moment is not the problem. That's yeah. Print parties today? Yeah, I think there's three or four. I think so. They're free, I think. Wow. Okay. It's another big day. There's a bunch overnight that HM that has to be punched in. Okay. And also, on all the October parties, they weren't online until last night, so they have to be punched into, uh, written on the desk calendar. Mm -hmm. They're in the system, but they're not on the desk calendar, so they have to be written down. You'll see them all in the mailbox there this morning. Uh, you forgot to remind me last night. Let's make it your fault. You forgot okay. to remind me. You put the new calendar dates so Yeah. But you forgot to remind me to punch in the October uh, registration. So it went open yes. last night. Got it. And it could have been that people could have reserved yeah. in, in advance. So can I make uh, it your fault? Whatever. Sure. I thought you had uh, one of those automatic reminder no, emails no, when no, I make no, 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 no. those My, dates. It's called Cameron. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, it did. It did. It came in, but I didn't, I didn't think about punching it. Sorry. I just, okay. Whatever. If the two of us try and remember it, there's a better chance of it getting done. Okay. And also, there's a, a couple of us that one inside Japan. While I was punching them in this morning, mm -hmm. one of the ones from inside Japan, the date on the heading of their email, and then the body of the, body of the email says whatever, well, the 13th, but the date on the thing inside, the, the doc the file con inside, yeah. it's a different date. Oh, no. So, so I'll contact back, them and I see wrote what's back, going I, did. I wrote back to this okay. one, you'll see it in the, in the print party box over on your side of the mail system, because okay. that's where the original reservation came in. So, mm. okay. so she will probably be getting back to us, it might already be there. Yeah. Dre's one two three says, "Is Dave going to be filling in the hair the same way as in the original with the black pigment thing?" Is this something you've discussed before? Do you know what they're talking no, about? No, the guy screwed up a bit. I don't know. These the, the part you see on the screen right now. There's there's red, which is going to be the black hair, and then there's white, gray mm -hmm. inside it. So the hairs are chopped out to give a light highlight. Right. They tried to do that in this area down here. That's in the screen now. It's black. Why is it black? That's actually paste and glue that filled those holes. He wasn't careful. Oh. So it's been really difficult for me. If I, if I hide this layer that I'm doing right now for a minute. Oh, yeah, see you this, can see that. See those black stripes? Yeah. So the dark black ones are the place where the paste filled in the lines. Huh. But because it didn't get hit by the baron, it didn't get transparentized. So it's yeah. just black. Huh. So those black lines actually should have been white, but they got filled in. Interesting. And then there's white paper showing through where the under hair gray stops. The under hair yeah. gray comes to here. This is white paper, and the guy was careless and filled them in. That's why it's taking me so long to do this instead of just taking it from Photoshop and picking it up and you know. Yeah. Huh. Yeah, it was on earlier. Just click with Photoshop, you can do marching ants and pick it up. And, well, no, you can't on yeah. well, something like this. You know. Okay, people are saying they're getting static now. Microphone. Mm -hmm. Closer to you. Oh. Apparently, there's. Well, see the sun said, oh, hi, who's I'm and then head upstairs. But someone sent a link of printer jokes. As in woodblock printer jokes? or Maybe. It says, why did the printer forget to say goodbye to his wife? He was pressed for time. <laughs> I think your reactions are funnier than the jokes. 
still static. I don't know what would be. We're talking about microphone. Or we're talking about visual stuff. What are you talking about? There's no. Yeah, it's audio. Sound check, please. Um, sound sounds like a buffer issue. No. Is it that we take the physical microphone itself and just move it to somewhere else for a minute. The mic has now been moved away from us. Testing the one, two, three. Be hearing the fan blowing. So it's a long way away now. Yeah. Before we had the mic clipped right next to it, we did, but not anymore. Hmm. It's just the Okai. Every stream has technical issues of one sort or another. The Mukohanka Yokai watching the hills. If I unplug them, I can put it back. In. It'll make a static jump in their head. Okay. So tell them what you're doing. Right. Heads up. You know, I'm They're going to take off your headphones. I'm going to unplug and plug in the mic. Yep. Here we go. Oh, I'm on the phone. Ohio is on my phone. Okay. Since back, he's been off for a week. He took a long, well deserved vacation. Yes. Not a long vacation, a well deserved vacation with his family. Is that right? What the got Thank you. No, no better. It's nice to have everyone sad. This is... Sorry. I don't know what to do. When well, you can temperature change, you can click. There's two mics here. There's the MacBook built-in mic, and there's the major mic. And one's turned off, and one's turned on. So you can you can slide down. Okay. You just slide down. Flexibility mic to the laptop. Testing, right. testing. One, two, three. It'll it'll have fan noise, and it's it's somewhere around here. It is. You can look in the port. What difference? Are we too quiet now? Is it bad? This is now the mic on the laptop. I think this, if you've got a hidden one, it's going to get really hot if you've got it packed under the flat. It's not cool. We can have it when I use this microphone. So it sounds like Dave's talking to us while he's walking away from us on a beach. <laughs> because it, the fan probably sounds like waves. But, oh well. All the reservations up to date, day two? Mm -hmm. For October? Quite a lot. Pardon me? The reservations aren't for today, but they're still out. Not new ones. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It looks way. 
less jaggy on the iPad compared to this system. So the battery won't. Hello. <clears throat> Can you still hear us okay, everyone? Is this section not part of Just be going in because I'm just working oh. my way around it by a bit better. I'm going to save the actual hair lines for last to get that in practice. Doesn't it? No breakfast thing. The last previous stream was upstairs on Monday, so I had to get all the gear down from the third floor. Ah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Smalls Ant says, Ray, what have you been learning now? Still carving or more printing? Well, I decided to not take carving class for now, so I'm still learning print parties. Yeah. yeah how to see the moisture of the paper and the print nicely. Right. Carving just seemed like too big a thing to take on right now. Mm -hmm. You're in school, you have lots of things going on, right? Mm -hmm. But it may be confusing. There is another Ray who is doing printing yeah. for us. Mm -hmm. But it's not this Ray. There's your next printer. Who needs med school? <laughs> Oh, no. I didn't say that. I mean, keep it quiet. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to get shot by an angry mother. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what are you doing to my daughter? Well, I don't know. It's just my decision. <laughs> That's good. Have you tried microwave yet? Um, 
eight eight on cool. No, I don't know any. Okay. I'm getting a lot of static on this yeah. stuff. A lot of people. Uh, it was somebody came in not yesterday Monday. They wanted the print party with it, and they thought it was up. You know, so oh, no. I've got to. I've got to pull it up to a, to a priority. You know. I cannot wait. <laughs> it's, should I? I don't know. Should I work on it today? I don't know what to do. I don't know. It's it's on my desk. It's waiting for me to to get the brushes ready to mark the blocks with the lines for gradations. Mm. And start training the staff. Yeah. What's there? Are what three parties today? What is it? Tomorrow's kind of a low party day, right? So far. Yeah, I think so. Nick. If if it turns out, then tomorrow really turns out to be a low party day. We can maybe do that. Yeah. Are you on tomorrow? What's this session tomorrow? It's Taiko Chan. They Taiko San. Um. Taiko Maybe we can, if the, if the reservation book stays low, then maybe tomorrow we can do that. Okay. Test run. Do the test run with the staff. Five people coming at 11 o'clock. Yeah, that's just a single shot, right? So. Yeah, that's one pretty pretty. Other spots are still. Yeah, and it's also, it's an off time. It's 11, 11.30 or something, what is it? It says 11. It's 11, yeah. Travel agency again, asking for off times. I don't remember. Oh. I don't remember. I think it's been in the books for a while. That was a out of range, right? Just a little bit. Yeah, it's long past time to get that microwave into, into service, of course, obviously. I'm not sure if I've been procrastinating or just overwhelmed. I don't know what to I think it's now moving into procrastination territory. So, yeah. It's enough to say I'm busy, but there's a both are true. There's X percent busy, X percent procrastination. Yeah. So, it's not hard. It's not easy to distinguish between the two. Yeah. Okay. And the other situations which are not clear for a while. Sleeping already? Eight thirty in the morning? Yeah. Well, I hear you about right now saying you really would like a cup of coffee. <laughs> Let's get this stream over. I'm gonna go get a cup of coffee. <laughs> Fourteen more minutes. Oh no! Well, I survived. <laughs> I'm getting done here. This is coming along well. Yeah, it's really coming along. But I think that pencil warned me, didn't it say you were about your pencil's about to die? Isn't that what came up on the screen a few minutes ago? I couldn't see your equipment too quick to So it says that I think it's at less than five percent battery remaining. Yeah. It's such surreal battery in your pencil is dying. It sounds like it sounds like something bizarre. There are so many devices with or that you draw without being battery powered. What does the battery power do to well, here the pencil is communicating with the yeah. with the electronics below the screen. Mm -hmm. It's 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 pressure sensitive. It's tilt sensitive. Yeah. It's uh, everything. Okay. So it, it, it's communicating back and forth. So it's not just simulating the touch of a finger. Like no, it's an electronic like, device. Yeah. This, 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 the the tip. If you look at their their website, they show you the tip is packed with electronics. Huh. There's like a motion sensor, a tilt sensor, all kinds of stuff. In there. Huh. So the screen knows what's going on from the pencil. Yeah. Okay. They're talking to each other. There's lots of sarcasm. Apple built some you need batteries and it's not replaceable. You gotta pay a fortune, whatever, blah blah blah. But it is a supremely wonderful tool. Mm -hmm. yeah. you know, even we ourselves who are basically Apple we're, we're steady Apple users. I guess I'm an Apple fan if that's what it means, whatever. I find many of their things frustrating, of course. But yeah. overall in balance, when I think about the alternatives, I'm quite happy to be part of the Apple universe, you know. Well, well, you and I were really frustrated about something the other day that was going on at Apple. I said something like the ghost of Steve Jobs lives or something. Yeah. What was it? Something frustrating? What well, was it? It was the OS. It just wouldn't let us do something because yeah. of 
resizing images and turning them. Oh yeah, what preview stuff. does. Yeah, yeah when you crop an image in preview and save it, it doesn't crop away what you cropped away. It saves it, but with a little marker saying, by the way, he just wants to see this little area in yeah. the So when you then send it to a different piece of software for use, it's forked, you know. Yeah. And Steve's philosophy of just hide it from the viewers. They don't need to know that stuff, you know. The, f the file name extensions and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. and it might be okay for my mother, but for some of us who like to understand how our computers work and want to know what we're doing, it's frustrating. Yeah. And not, they, they, they had a trouble with all of Apple's life. It's been that stretch between those two things. How much of a consumer product is it and how much of a, you know, a professional machine is it? Yeah. So I get it. It's not easy to draw the line between those two things. And you're going to alienate one or the other side at almost every point along yeah. the road. So, you know. It's okay. Can I, can I, we, we bitched about it yesterday, but nah, whatever. We bitch and move on. Yeah. At least we know how it works. We understand. <laughs> Audrey's asking, should I open the shutter? Yes, yeah. yes, of course. Get going. Audrey, huh? <laughs> Except don't train him to slam it open. Oh, I know, I want it to go up slow because yeah. once we get that graphic on it, I don't want to. Yeah. Yeah, good morning. Good morning. How are you, Sam? How you doing? You okay from last week? Yeah, Did you survive? I'm so sorry. Oh, no, no problem. I'm so sick. Oh, no. <coughs> Thank you. What do you want to know? Tracing. A naked lady. <laughs> if you really want to know. Next I, question. I, I did. You did. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Japan is still a land of good traditional pens and pencils. But nobody uses the eraser on any of the pencils. I find that so bizarre to me. But I don't find it bizarre at all. I think you know, a specialized tool, you know. Uh, what do you think? In, in Britain, they have these little things, erasers on the end of the pencils, like this, tick, tick, tick. Yeah. Do you like that, or would you rather have a specialized eraser? Um, yeah, I'd rather have it. And then, like, I never use the rubber on the no. outside of pencil. Yeah. I know my yeah. friends yeah. use it. I'm like, no! Why? Because it's beautiful without using it. Like, with the, if you don't use rubber... <laughs> the lick is, we're listening, keep speaking. Yeah. Our, our, both of our faces just went, what? what? <laughs> it's, it's, okay. it's nicer and... But wait, 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 okay. When you sharpen a pencil, it's beautifully clean and sharp. You can't mm. use it because you're going to spoil it. No, that's okay because that's pencil. But the rubber is... What? Like, what? Can't, what? You can't even rubber it out with letters and all that. That's why you have the rubber itself rather than... Okay, wait, 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 stop talking. you got to translate because you're using the word rubber in the English term as a, we, we call it eraser. Yeah. No, no, I'm not being sarcastic, just so people won't understand what you're talking mm -hmm. about. Yeah. In Britain they call those things rubbers, as in yeah. Canada we would call it the eraser. Yeah. But you can rub the, the words down, right? But it's also made of rubber. Yes, so but the thing is in, in America, uh, rubber is a whatever, different thing. Different thing whatever. Yeah. <laughs> right. Okay. But, yes. Yeah, so. So, but just a minute, you're, you're serious about this, you don't want to use it because it would spoil it. It's a tool to be used. Yeah, no, but then it's tiny and you can't even rubber it out. Okay, that's a different question. It's not so efficient is what you're saying. Yeah. I get that. I get as that. Well okay. As okay. I just don't like to use it. Do you it. think it's a cultural thing? Because it seems to be. I think most of the Japanese people don't use it. Especially, like my friends don't use yeah, it. Yeah, I've never seen a yeah, Japanese person. When I went to England, I went on it. Like, okay, well, let's roll this back. I remember when I was a kid, we had you know the pencil boxes in school. And I did have an eraser in it. It was a bit of a different shape than yeah. the Japanese ones. It had a trapezoid. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And yeah, I used yeah. to stick my pencil in it and stand it up on the desk. So yeah. the eraser would get full of all these black graphite circles. Oh, <laughs> Cameron's yeah. been there, done that. Oh, so, yes. so, I did that as well. Hmm. But, Rubber that is on the end of the pencil, that's different. Yes, I don't know about you, but for me, they was just got, within a minutes of coming alive, they got chewed off. That's all it was, too. You bite them and chew it off, and that's it. I didn't chew it in, in a sense of being nervous, like chewing the fingernails, but it's just too big of a target, and that's it. Bang. It's gone. It gets chewed off. I love it because I can write, and then when I mess up, just turn it around, erase. Put it back over. It's still, it doesn't work well that clean, nicely. You must have had bad erasers. <laughs> what's, no, what's, I mean, what's the chat to... consensus here? Are people, you know, do people use the erasers on the end of a pencil or not? Over here in Japan, clearly it's no. 
Yeah. Reach and shake your head again. You can't believe it. I just can't imagine yeah. someone. Yeah. It's like um, they have a mechanical pencil as well, yeah. and mm. it is like that, and yeah. so it's like extra rubber so that you can change when you yeah. finish like you. Yeah, that. yeah, yeah. But I never ever used it. Well, usually at yeah. the back of a mechanical pencil is a compartment with extra legs yeah. to go yeah. to the side. But still. Whoa. What's this? Food! Oh, yeah, Master Alka! Ah, yes. How are you? Yeah, good day! Hi, hi, hi. 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 コーヒー、ちょっとカラメル。そう、してない。そう。イエーイ。ホワイトチョコ。ホワイトチョコ。うん。キャメラマさん、上で撮っといてないから下でもって持ってって食べてもいいし。ここで食べてもいいし。じ
one of these, what is it, OC? No, what's no, what's no, the OC. initials I'm searching for here? Obsessive, Obsessive compulsive, yeah. you know, whatever. I don't think I know. It's when you walk down the street, do you step on the cracks in the sidewalk? Are you okay? What do you mean? Oh, okay, she's all right. <laughs> <laughs> there are people, uh, some of whom will remain unnamed, when you walk in on the sidewalk, you know, there's blocks of concrete, there's mm -hmm. crack lines on the sidewalk. You don't get what I'm talking about. Yes, good, you're safe. Okay, that's good. Okay. Don't, don't. You walk on concrete. There are people who cannot step on those lines. Oh, like, these walk only here between the crack and never um, mind. Sometimes when I'm bored, <laughs> I do think about that. Like once there's like you know like bricks and it's like one part of one, mm -hmm. but then I have an iron. So you're borderline. Yeah, yeah. What? Borderline. Which is okay. <laughs> Or, for example, when you're reading a book, yeah. you're reading the text, the words, and then your brain on the back, there's another part of your brain that is checking every sentence to see if it has an even number of words or an odd number of words. And it has to identify, before you finish the sentence, it has to identify the middle word if it's odd, so that you know you're climbing up the hill or you're climbing down the hill with every sentence you read. I've you don't never do this? heard of this one. Okay, okay, let's, let's change the subject here. It's all right. It's... What? You can't see it? Not your active brain, it's a part of your brain in the background that has to determine where the middle of the sentence is, so as is to know whether you're halfway through the sentence or not. It's just working away in the background without any control, you know, a sub-program. Background process. Yeah, background process, I think. And sometimes it gets a bit too close to the foreground and you get, oh, I've got to go back to that sentence again because I didn't quite catch it the first time around. There are, there's no, no real people like this. No, it's just, it's just old totally people, like theoretical this. example. Oh. <laughs> You're in the car running down the highway. You know, in the old days when there were telephone poles beside the highway, counting them. Not counting them against the same thing. They were in groups, because there's always a taller one with taller groups. Are they, how are you halfway through? Where's the middle of the group? What are the group? There are no people like that. Yeah, of course not. Oh, hey, it's Ladies' Day. All the ladies are present. Good. Shibasan, get to work and make more prints because we're selling out. More ghost, 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 ghost. Yeah, eat pie. Eat pie, eat pie. So, do you, does that make you happy when you come in the door? <laughs> Lots of people took the prints. It's got it. Shibasan, I'm in Yoru. I'm in Yoru. I'm in Yoru. It shows up, it looks nice under the light. People come in out of the dark street outside, they see the light shop, they go straight to your print. I didn't even know how many, three or four we sold in the evenings. Wow. <laughs> and yesterday a guy came in, he wanted your biography. He's a print dealer here in Tokyo. He bought a bunch of prints here yesterday. He's going to sell them. I'm switching to English, I'm sorry. あの、ディーラです。あの、ウキウエ協会なんとかなんとか会協会。あ、イタリア人。あ、そう。で、いくつか買って、自分が売る。で、シバさんもちょっとデータ、いつ生まれたとか、あの、作者のデータ欲しか
Yeah, yeah, so yeah. That's 14 it. impressions. Mm. Wow. I would have expected a few more. もう,うわーっつってむちゃくちゃに作ったやつだからね<笑>朝香先生にもっと丁寧にやれって言われてすみません<笑><笑> thing is,、uh, Do you look at this as 浮世絵 or do you look at this as modern print? じゃあ創作版がですか浮世絵ですか浮世絵から見るとすりをちょっと、うん、ちょっとですね創作版の場合から見るとパーフェクトでしょえっとねその間でで、うん、私の中では浮世絵だけど意味が違うんです、うんうん、浮世絵の一番最初の意味憂いっていう悲しみの世の中っていうものの浮世絵そこから江戸時代になったら人々の生活を表した浮かれ浮かぶっていうのに世の中の世っていうものに変わったんですね私は一番最初の憂いの世悲しみの世の中っていうのと創作版画を合わせてますそう意味のないような話ですね、うん、技術的な技術的は創作版画です、うんあそこまで江戸みたいなあんな美しいものはやっぱどれかに特化しないとできないですよ、うん、技術は創作版で変われば全然問題ない綺麗にできた、うん、そういやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいやいもっとうまくなるように頑張ります。うん、すごい今,今月も人気です。<笑>あれの今月の名前を売れたかわからない。うん、で偶然、この店知らなかった人が入って、僕たちはセールスじゃないよ。うん、we're, not, we're not pushing it or selling it. They just pick it up and they buy. ありがとうございます。<笑>あ,あと残りあれ入れて3枚なので。うん You know, 9月の後半か10月入ってから多分滑ると思うんです、うんま、だちょっとどっちが先次のものが先次のものが先です、okay. であの作品展で準備して落ち着いたらあれをするのでちょっとまだ、うん、あと多分多めにもしかしたらインターネット販売用にあと5枚ぐらいもしかしたら残ってるかもしれないのでそしたらそインターネット販売うちのインターネット販売が来たときに、多めから発注するじゃないですか。ちょっと待って、どこにあるのウェブサイトはい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。I can't finish it out now. Hawaiian, 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 Hawaiiian, Hawaiian, 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 Hawaiiian, 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 Hawa